Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Sex Tech. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when the Wi-Fi option is not showing up in the settings on your Windows 11 computer. So this is actually relatively easy to fix. Now, the first thing we want to do is go on down to where it says search and then type in services just like this and go to the services applications and open this up. Now this window will appear. Now just select one of the services and then press W and you'll be brought to the W section and scroll on down until we get to where it says WLAN auto config right here. Right click on this and then go to properties. Now under here, go to service status and make sure you have this selected start. Then go to startup type and go to automatic. Once you have those selected, go to apply and see if it shows up now. Doesn't show up, let's go back down to search and then type in device manager and go to the device manager control panel. Now under here, let's go on down to network adapters and expand this and locate your wireless adapter. So mine is called Intel dual band wireless AC 3168. Then I'm going to right click on it and I'm going to go to update driver. Now you have two options under here. You can search automatically for drivers. Otherwise you can go to browse my computer for drivers. So I'm going to go to the bottom option. Then let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. Let's select this. Then I have two of them on here. One's from Intel and the other one is from Microsoft. So I'm going to go to the one that says Intel and then go to next. And it's installing the driver on my computer now. And it's successful. Now you can restart your computer. Now go to the Windows Start button and then go to Power and restart your computer and see if it will show up under the Wi-Fi section on your settings now. If it doesn't, go back to the device manager, then go back to network adapters and go to your wireless adapter, right click on it, and then go to properties this time. And then you can go to power management and you can go to allow the computer to turn off the device to save power. And you can try on check marking this and then going to okay. Also, you can right click on your wireless adapter once again. And instead of going to update driver, try going to uninstall the device and then restart your computer after that. Now, if those tips don't work, go back down to search and type in system configuration and go to this application, then go to services and make sure all these services under here are enabled. If you don't see something enabled, just check mark it. Otherwise there's an option on the bottom of the screen right here that says enable all. Then go to apply and go to okay. So hopefully this video did indeed help you out. If it did, leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more tech help videos coming up next on your six tech.